Hey guys, got a little short video talking about a problem I have with my computer, with my gaming computer, that I'll uh, tell you guys, and uh, I don't know, maybe we'll figure it out too, if we can. So, let's get into the video. As you guys can tell, this is my uh, Fantex case, which I kind of thought might be the issue to this. Um, first off, the issue is my computer, once it turns off, it'll restart automatically, and like it does that no matter what I do, basically. Uh, originally, I thought it was the Fantex case, which is the N2 Pro. So I went ahead and uh, removed all of those wires and everything. Because if those, like basically what I did was I used that to turn it on. Then I ripped all those cables out, which they're not really going to cause an issue. Um, and then uh, I, and then like I restarted the computer through Windows. And then it would auto still automatically restart. So it's definitely a problem with the... Motherboard, I believe. I mean, what do you guys think? So uh, let's go ahead and try it out. As you can tell, like the power is off. I'll go ahead and flip it back on. And as you can like tell, like the power's back on now. So um, I plugged everything back in, but uh, so like I can turn the computer back on and everything. And you know, everything else on the computer runs fine, but I got to restart the computer, and uh, basically it keeps going out of the loop. And the only way to actually turn it off is to just go behind that power supply and then flip the switch, uh, which obviously kind of sucks. That's not really the fun way to turn off a computer. Um, especially since, I don't I mean like, usually what I do is I turn off the computer, let it go to like the BIOS screen, and then I flip the switch. That's usually how I turn it off. Um, it's been doing this for about a week. So let's go ahead and, uh, uh, there's my emo if you guys really want it. Um, I don't really care that much, um, but um, oh yeah. So let's go ahead and rip all these cables out. Now, these are really just the power switch, the reset switch, the, um, let's see, uh, the hard drive LED, and then the uh, lights for the power switch. So it's really nothing critical that I'm pulling out, in case you guys are wondering. Like, if I just yanked on, like, this uh, power cord from my R9 Nano, that would cause some issues, but <laughs> that's not really gonna cause an issue. But as we can see, there's nothing plugged into those little headers down there at all, so if, I mean, as far as I know, you know, let's go ahead and go through Windows and uh, shut down this computer, and uh, we'll see what happens, I guess. Um, by the way, nice keyboard. I like this uh, K70 keyboard. It's still pretty badass. Um, since this is still on, we can tell that the computer is still on. I do have an SSD in this computer, but it still takes um, maybe like 20 seconds to restart. Go ahead and listen to it restart. Getting closer. Okay. And as you can probably tell from the sounds it's making, it just turned back on, which, yeah, kind of sucks. Um, so, yeah, nothing's plugged in right there. So, as far as I know, it's got to be an issue with um, the motherboard itself. I guess maybe that section of the motherboard. I really have no idea. I don't think it would do anything related to the graphics card or, like, my expansion cards, my USB 3.0 expansion cards, or... I guess my other expansion card, which is a um, wireless uh, router or wireless adapter. I don't know. What do you guys think? Any suggestions over there in the comment section? I don't know. Maybe I don't think my RAM would cause an issue. I can't even get the RAM off with this big ass heatsink on there. Um, so yeah, it restarted. So uh, let me know what you guys think about that. It's a really weird issue. Never heard anything about this ever before. Um, I don't know. Should I just go ahead and replace the motherboard? It's not even that good of a motherboard. You can even tell the the, the PCB is blue. Like. I spent like 60 bucks on this motherboard, <laughs> but uh, let me know what you guys think, and uh, I'll see you crazy motherfuckers later. Drop a like on the video if you want to, and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more computer stuff in the future. Beyond that, you guys have a crazy motherfucking day, and I'll see you later. Peace out.